This reading is for my Scorpios. Okay? I want to say thank you to all my subscribers, all my new subscribers. Welcome. If you haven't already hit that bell button, hit that bell button at the bottom so you can get a notification each time I upload. Look what just popped out. Thank you, Holy Spirit. You kicked them out your life. And this person is bothered because why? Their trickery didn't work. Okay? I feel like you was a therapist to this person. You was a very healing, you was a very healing energy to this person. And someone is just mad because their spell work is not working. Holy Spirit, divine, my ancestors of the highest way, right? My spirit, God, and my holy angel, Archangel Michael. Please protect me and my collective sunsies while I channel the energies for them. Thank you, Holy Spirit. What is the current energy for my beautiful collective sunsies? Please and thank you. I feel like you guys are happy and a beautiful energy and someone is just upset that you're unbothered, okay? I feel like you guys are in a good energy. Holy Spirit, give me some messages for my collective sunsies. What is the current energy for them right now? Okay, so Spirit gave me three. Guidance. I feel like you guys are being very guided at this time by this, um, you know, by the higher ups. Addiction, okay? This could be someone that's overindulgent in addictions, guarded, okay? I feel like um, you are being guided, okay? Are you receiving some type of guidance, okay? To keep you 10 steps ahead of the um, the game, okay? And someone is um, could be overindulgent in some type of addictions or have some type of addiction problem. And you're just, you're just guarded right now. You're guarded towards this energy because I feel like it's something that, yeah, cautious. There's something about this person that you see that just ain't right. This could be somebody that you was in a romantic relationship with. If not, this could be someone in your family. Okay? But I feel like, like earlier, what I just said, I feel like also you were some type of guidance to this person. Like, you was a, a big ball of light, like a sunshine to this person's life. Whoever um, suffered from these type of addictions. But I feel like with this guarded card, I feel like you're real guarded towards your energy right now. This is somebody that you don't want to mingle with. You don't, you know... Or this is something that you needed to do. You needed to be guarded towards this person, okay, who you was trying to, um, you know, guide and help. Yeah, we have arrested. Give me some more cards, Holy Spirit. This person could be going to jail or just be in spiritual jail at this time. This person could be facing some type of karma. Yeah, purified. Yeah, purified meant to be. I feel like you are this, like, big boy of light, like I said, meant to be, okay? Somebody could be feeling like um, something was, I don't know if you hear them sirens, but something is definitely confirmation for you guys. Somebody is feeling like you were meant to be in their life. They feeling like this person who's this big ball of light is supposed to be in my life. They're supposed to be, they supposed to be around. How dare you not be around while I'm going through all of this right now with arrested? How dare you not be around while I'm going through all of this hardship and, you know, things are um, not looking right in my life. But I feel like, you know, that's what happens, right? When you when you don't appreciate somebody that's trying to help you, you don't appreciate a good person, you know, things happen. Things happen. And sometimes your back got to be put against the wall so you to realize, like, you know, who was there for me? Who had my back? Give me another card on this arrested card, Holy Spirit. Yeah, because somebody was jumping to conclusions before, but now they're all in their feelings. Could be a water sign, don't have to be. But um, with that submerging in emotion, somebody is all in their feelings. I feel like this person jumped to conclusions when it came to you or had others around them jumping to conclusions. This person could have been spreading rumors, lies about you. This person has some type of addiction where they're trying to numb the pain. Yeah, they thought that shit was funny, Sunseed. They thought that shit was funny. They thought it was funny, but they don't think it's funny no more. They don't think it's funny no more. Yeah, because access is denied. You're not communicating with this person. You don't want no access to this person. You don't want nothing to do with this person. Something could be something fit about New Year's, but you definitely, um, you could have kicked this person out your life around New Year's last year, or something could be something fit about New Year's that's coming. 
But somebody's coming to a breaking point, okay? Yeah. Let's talk on the tarot, something. Somebody felt like you was all they needed, but I feel like this person um, mistreated you. They did. And now you're you're blocking out all communication with this person. You don't want nothing to do with this person, okay? Um, for some of you guys, you just could be somebody where you was there when they were arrested, okay? You was just like, somebody was just feeding off your energy, okay? Somebody could have been definitely feeding off your, your good energy, but I feel like you guarded towards this person right now. You gave this person some type of guidance. Holy Spirit, give me some messages, please, and thank you for my beautiful collective stuff. This could be a friend. I'm picking up as well. Somebody, somebody want to be more than friends. What is going on, something? Holy Spirit, give me some more messages. Thank you. We have the Queen of Pentacles and we have the Two of Wands. Okay, so somebody could see you as someone who's very abundant. You know, very humble, very grounded, very mature, down to earth. Um, very generous. You guys could be entrepreneurs, but I feel like you was very generous and, and, and kind-hearted to this person. You was some type of guidance to this person who suffered from some type of addictions. But I feel like with the two, Queen of Pentacles and the Two of Wands, you are making a decision to walk away from this person and guard your heart. You are cutting up all communication. You don't want nothing to do with this person anymore, okay? Whoever this person that was arrested and purified and meant to be, someone, um, I feel like somebody is bonded to something, okay? Somebody that have some type of... Um, negative entity that's attached to them and i feel like with you being in this purified energy and meant to be um i feel like you was meant to be because some people everybody is not the same you can't play with everybody just like i always say god love everybody but everybody's not chosen you can't play with everybody i feel like um i don't see the justice card out here but i see it in my third eye you could have been um you could have brought karma to this person, whether it is good or bad. But somebody, spirit could have brought you in this person's life because spirit knew that this person's intentions wasn't really right. Okay? Spirit brought you in this person's life to be some type of guidance to this person who suffered from some type of addictions. Okay? I feel like this person wrongfully did you in some type of way. And now you're guarding. You're blocking all communication. You could have this person blocked. But what the arrested and purified meant to be, you was um, supposed to be in this person's life. Okay? And guide them in some type of way. It was up to them to choose how they was going to um, precipitate your energy and what they was going to do with it. But now that you put your energy back, somebody's in the emotions because I feel like before they would jump into conclusions. You know, um, they thought shit was funny. They, you know, they thought it was a game. They thought she was going, um, they thought something was meant to be. They thought she was going to be there. Because some people could take, you know, some people take advantage of people that um, of the light, you know, because they feel like you're so pure, you're so nice. This person is going to always be there, you know. No, it don't work like that. Um, I'm sure you guys set up some type of boundaries, okay? I'm getting more of the Queen of Swords. Now, somebody set up some type of um, Queen of Swords or Seven of Wands. Somebody set up boundaries with this person. That whoever this person is, they, th they, they thought it was just like you was going to always be there. Someone sees you as very magical, but somebody would jump in the gun like, you know, oh, I think this person will always be there. <laughs> I could do whatever I want to do. <laughs> but no, Spirit was like, no. Queen of Pentacles with the two of wands at the bottom. Somebody is making a choice, okay? Yeah, three of Pentacles. You guys could be focused on work at this time, the lovers. This also could be a lover, uh, somebody who you was in a relationship with. But with the Five of Cups here, I feel like somebody is sad. Okay, they crying over spilled milk. This is somebody that's, you know, in despair right now, focused on, you know, focused on the, the loss of losing you. Okay, this is somebody that's um constantly reminiscing about you, feeling sad, feeling a lot of grief, abandonment, because you're no longer in their life. But with the Six of Wands, with the Seven of Swords, I feel like this person was all about the attention. Okay, this person probably wasn't giving you the attention that um you deserve. Okay. And you were just trying to be a help to this person. And maybe this person, you know, got a little big-headed. With this arrested, um, like I said, I don't know if this person is in spiritual jail or um, physical jail. Or if this person could be somebody who got released, okay? And you was there for them. But with the six of one and seven of swords, somebody was all about the attention. They thought they was hot shit. 
But this person was sneaky. They had alternative, you know, um, hitting a, uh, had a hidden agenda the whole time. This person betrayed you. Emperor could be an Aries, a father figure, or a boss. Somebody was used to you, you know. Um, I'm, I'm getting like an energy vampire. An energy vampire. Somebody felt like you were just perfect. Um, this person, um, they just thought that you would be there. They thought you would be there. It was like, this person is perfect. They meant to be in my life. I can have these nasty, disgusting um, addictions. I know I got this uh, beautiful um, person of the highest white light around me, you know, constantly guiding me. But with the guard and the assets and I, you decided to pull your energy back and turn your back. Somebody feel like your love is real magical. Give me a card on the, yeah, put the death card, the ace of cups. Somebody took back their love. Somebody took back their love. Somebody is going towards new love, not a pinnacle, is deciding to be single with the star card and heal themselves. Somebody is pulling back. Somebody is pulling back. They decided to focus on them right now and heal themselves and focus on new love. Okay? Somebody no longer wants to work with whoever this lover is. Somebody is choosing to go a whole other direction. I feel like this person is looking at you, though. Whoever this person is that's in sad and grief that you have blocked, they looking at you. Somebody is focused on you. And somebody know that they're missed out because they was being sneaky. Somebody was all about the attention. Let me call on the Queen of Pentacles, Holy Spirit. Please and thank you. Sunseed, I got the card full enough. Ready, Sunseed. Okay, Queen of Pentacles was clarified with the Eight of Wands, but we had the Eight of Wands in reverse. Okay, so yeah, with assets of nine and guarded, you, there's no communication with you and this person. This is somebody that you're no longer in contact with. You pulled your energy back, but this person is somewhere with this five of cups, they somewhere drowning in their emotion. Someone is definitely in despair because they focus on the loss of losing someone like you. But with the seven of swords and the six of wands, this person was sneaky. I feel like this person was a attention seeker. They wanted attention from everybody. Instead of, you know, putting that focus into the person that was there for them, they decided to, you know, just be just out here, just getting attention from everybody else. They just thought that with the profile meant to be that, oh, you was going to always be there. It was just meant to be. You will always be around. They thought that shit was funny. Spirit, give me some more for my um, collective fun seeds. You could be dealing with a um, um, cancer Pisces. I'm sorry. I don't even have cancer Pisces for people out here. But it could be a Cancer Pisces Scorpio. Like I said earlier with the water sign, submerging emotion, it could be a Cancer Pisces Scorpio. Or this could be a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Gemini. Holy Spirit, give me some more. Somebody thought you would always stay. Five of Wands. Somebody thought you was going to always stay with this person. Eight of Wands in reverse, you are blocking out all conflict, all communication. You don't want no drama. You don't want no beef. You don't want none of that. None of that. This is somebody that tried to have you in competition with someone else. You don't want no problem. That's what I'm saying when I picked up earlier when, before I pulled the spread. Somebody is mad because you're not bothered sunseed somebody wanted you to be bothered but you somewhere like you're not bothered somebody knows that their attention was pure somebody know that they were trying to help somebody who just thought that you would just always be there no you set up boundaries period empress come through every time what did i say i see the justice card in my third eye okay this could be somebody that is arrested or um work for the legal system this person could be a correction officer um a cop a firefighter, but it's somebody that do something in the justice system. Okay. Yeah, but you, I cannot make it up. What did I say earlier? Queen of Swords. This Empress put up boundaries. Yes, this Empress is very loving, caring, and very nurturing. Yes, she is. She is, I mean, all of that. Very creative, abundant, beautiful, very beautiful, nurturing. She is a divine feminine. But at the same time, somebody slept on you. Somebody slept on that. They didn't know that it was nothing for you to throw that sword up and set boundaries. Somebody played on your kindness. But you're very intelligent. You're very smart. And the Queen of Swords is also, you know, an observer. Okay? You observe before you make any moves. So you watch to see how this person was going to move. And this person showed you exactly who they were. Just because you loving and caring, this person don't must don't know that you have 
you get that out, but you even have even more for yourself. You love yourself. You wasn't gonna put up with no no nobody trying to put you in competition or being problematic, full of drama. You wasn't gonna do that. And the ones that reverse somebody that just cutting off all communication to this person that's focusing on their business. Six of Cups. This could be somebody from your past, or this could this could be something that happened in the past already. Six of Cups with the Nine of Wands, Page of Pentacles. Four Wands. Yeah, this person, whoever this person is, I feel like um you put you this person put you through a lot since these. You've been through a lot, okay? You either um could have learned something new, went to school. A lot of you guys could be a nurture nurture nurture. Uh, Damn, somebody trying to mess with my throat chakra. They need to stop because I'm still going to say what I got to say. Period. I'm picking up on somebody in nursing school as well. Somebody could be in nursing school. Or you guys could be in school. A lot of you guys could be going to get your bachelor's, your master's. But somebody could be in school learning something. Okay. It also could be something in divination as well. But whatever it is, it's going to bring you a lot of stability after dealing with a situation with somebody um, that she was messing with in the past that um, had you in your head. Eight of Swords and the Justice, somebody definitely could be getting arrested, like I said. Somebody could be arrested or was arrested. But with the Ten of Pentacles and the King of Pentacles, with the Queen of Wands, somebody feels like you're very financially stable, um, very reliable, very beautiful inside and out. Queen of Wands with the Sun card, you a bad man pajama. Very beautiful. You could be someone who's also in the fashion industry or dressed very well. But you could do something in fashion. But you, your light is shining so beautiful. Yeah, but somebody is now reflecting. Give me a card on the Three of Pentacles, Holy Spirit. Please and thank you for my beautiful collective sun. Please. Something backfired on somebody. Yeah, the Three of Pentacles is playing five with the Star card and the Nine of Pentacles. Whoever this person in this single energy, um, Sun Seeds, I feel like this person, for a lot of you guys, this is you. Thank you, Spirit. You guys are single right now in the Nine of Pentacles, self-sufficient, hardworking. Just focus on your independence and going hard and focus on work. But somebody also want to come in and heal a situation with you as well. Yeah, now they want to take action. Now, yeah, the King of Wands with the Tower, Knight of Cups. Somebody is reflecting. Something blew up in somebody's face. Somebody thought that shit was funny before. They really did. They thought it was funny. Now, they, um, now whoever this um, fire sign is, fire sign on Scorpio, now they want to come in and take action and offer you something. Okay? Yeah, three of wands. You turned your damn back. A lot of you guys turned your back. You felt like this person was a burden. Ace of wands. You decided to get a new beginning. For a lot of you guys, you guys are focused on your wealth at this time. Before you guys are focused on your bag. I'm picking up strongly on the energy that just thought you was going to always be there, son. See, okay, always going to be there. I feel like somebody watches you, but I feel like you're very aware of whoever this person that watches you. I'm picking up on the energy where you guys are very enlightened, okay? Or you will be enlightened about the situation. Holy Spirit, give me a card on the lovers, please, and thank you. Yeah, Ten of Cups and the King of Wands, okay? For a lot of you guys, yeah, with the King of Cups. This could be, this is somebody that is in love with you. I'm going to be honest. This is somebody that is in love with you. They see you as their emotional fulfillment. But this person could have tried to came at you on just like, you know, having, you know, want to have sex with you, but didn't want to give you the commitment that you deserve. Okay. They thought they was going to play around with the Empress. Spirit said they was never, it was never going to be a go. They was going to immediately be blocked. Okay. You are this person's happiness. You are this person. This person has a lot of feelings and emotions for you. The Ten of Cups and the King of Cups, that is a lot of emotions. Somebody is really in love with you, okay? But I feel like the way how this person was coming at you, thinking that they could, you know, be a player, or they could come at you on some just, you know, sex, or thinking they could just get attention from other players. This is somebody that just gave me that. I'm getting a very non-committal energy. Somebody was non-committed to, Okay? Very non-committal. Let me see something. Let me put from the truth deck. Somebody was non-committal. Very non-committal. But they thought that you was going to be there. Give me a card on the um, Knight of Wands, King of Cups. 
and kick them. This is somebody that, that felt like, oh, I know, I know this is my person. With the prayer fire meant to be, thank you, spirit. I know that whoever this person is that's of the highest white right light, very beautiful in this emperor's energy, I know this is my person, but I'm going to go around and play around and get attention because I know this person ain't going to go nowhere with the humor card. They thought it was funny. They thought it was funny. Somebody really thought that you was going to be there. But somebody knew that you were a person because we kept seeing the emperor. Somebody knew that you was a person, but they thought you was going to be there. Mm. Yeah, they played a lot of games. They played a lot of games. Games. Give me a card on the Knight of Wands and the Ten of Cups. Somebody like, I know this my person. You know, I know they're not going to leave. But let me go out and, you know, and um get attention, do what I want to do right now. I know they still going to be there. What? With the Nine of Pentacles and the Star Card, a lot of you guys could be celibate. Okay. A lot of you guys could have um, not even been open to giving this energy even sex. So somebody was like, you know what? I'm going to go around and play. Okay, yeah, the healing. Somebody, somebody's a star. Somebody is a healer. Somebody is a healer. Period. There you go, Empress. You got two Empress cards. What you guys? This Empress is a healer. Okay, you have healed this person. We seen the therapist in the beginning. Somebody thought they was somebody's an energy vampire. They're in a low vibrational self. Whoever this Knight of Wands, Ten of Cups, with the King of Cups. Somebody like I noticed my person. They make me happy. I got a lot of love for them. But at the same time, this somebody that wanted to go out and get attention from others somewhere else. And you guys could have kept your legs closed and held back. Just to see how this person was going to move, maneuver. Give me another card on this. Um, first the Holy Spirit, please. Thank you. You guys are a healer. Somebody's a healer. Or oh, you just have this very healing energy about you. Thank you, Holy Spirit. We have the mirror. Yeah, you mirror something back to this person. This person now having a realization. Okay. Also, this person, like I said, yeah, they was non-committal, not very slow, but something is definitely changing. Something is definitely changing. Could be a Sagittarius or a Cancer Pisces Scorpio. Yeah, we have romance and affection, contemplation. Yeah, because this is where they want to be now, or romance of and affection and contemplation. This is what they somewhere reflecting, Sunseeds, because this is what they want now. But they were slow to give you that. Somebody thought they had enough time to go around and play games with you. Somebody thought they had enough time to go out and seek attention. Okay, thinking it was a man or a woman, whoever it is. But I've got very heavy empress energy here. Somebody thought they could go out and get attention, seek attention from other play, other people. Okay, and knowing that um, whoever this person is, you know, that, that carries themselves well, respects their body, um, um, mentally, spiritually, physically, Oh, they had just be there for me. I know, um, yeah. Okay. This is somebody that you could have been um knowing since you was a child with this puppy love crush. Okay. You could have been um knowing this person for a very long time. But I feel like this is an energy that just felt like you was gonna be there. And with the romance and affection and contemplation, somebody is like somewhere thinking, like, damn, I should have did that to that empress. Or I should have did that to that, you know, um, you know, that person that was very healing to me. Now somebody is reflecting. Like, I should have gave more. I should have been, you know, committed to this person. I should have been dedicated. They are the one who who uh, makes me happy, who I'm in love with, who I have a lot of passion for. But I thought I had enough time, you know, to go around and seek attention from other places. And when this person was, you know, telling me how they feel and, you know, um, how it made them uncomfortable with the humor card, I thought it was funny. I thought it was funny. I thought I had enough time, okay? Because this, because I feel like this is a meant to be connection. But somebody said, hell no. Eight of wands in reverse and five of wands. Somebody said, how dare you think you ever gonna put me in competition with anybody? There's no, no there's no comparing. Somebody set a boundary. That's why you had the Empress with the Queen of Swords. Somebody like, uh-uh. They ain't know how much strength they have, you, period. They ain't know how strong you was. You kept it the hell moving, son, season, period. Left them right out in the cold. Five of Pentacles. You are rejecting this person with the Six of Swords and going about your way. Because with the Knight of Pentacles, this person took too damn long. Now somebody is watching you, peeking and spying. Because they know that they didn't give you the commitment that you deserve. They took too long. They thought you would always be there. Somebody thought they had enough time on their hands. Now someone is somewhere having whatever addiction this is, whether it's sex addiction, drug addiction, whatever it is. You're guarded towards this person right now. You're not in communication. This is a no contact communication, whoever this is. 
Okay. Give me a card on the Seven of Swords, Holy Spirit. Seven of Swords, please and thank you. Yeah, the magician with the Page of Swords. Somebody thought they could manipulate a situation with you. Okay? Somebody thought they was going to manipulate a situation. Okay? Mm -mm. This person going to be watching you heavily on some type of social media or platform. For a lot of you guys, it's a platform. Whether it's TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, it's some it's some way that this person is watching you on social media. So they also could be watching you to see if you moved on, okay? Judgment in a chariot. You could have caught judgment on a cancer or made a final decision with the death card, could be a Scorpio. But someone has definitely pulled their energy back. Somebody is like, no, I'm not gonna do this with you. What's the eight of wands in reverse, Holy Spirit? Yeah, five of swords. Now this person's feeling defeated, okay? This person could be looking at you and giving you the evil eye, the stink eye. Like somebody really, I heard stink eye. <laughs> this person could be giving you the evil eye. Somebody mad because you was 10 steps ahead of the game. Yeah, the tower can never make it up. Scorpio energy, okay? Six of cups. I feel like you was the... This is this something that happened in the past. Or oh, this giving me also, somebody is reminiscing to all in their feelings because we got some emotion. Somebody is all in their feelings when it comes to you. And yeah, they in their feelings a lot. It's a, it's a lot on them. Because they constantly thinking about this connection and the love that you gave. And now somebody is feeling like, well, damn. I should have came toward this person and gave them that offer. I'm picking up on a very he heavy celibate energy. So, yeah, spirit, <laughs> my spirit guys was like, that's a damn true ace of swords. Somebody will be hurt if you decided to um, give your love or your body to somebody else. Okay? You only always got free will. Okay? If you decide to move on and fall in love, then you do what you want to do. This person is just going to have to deal with their karma of losing you. For others, let's see, let's pick up, let's see. There was a towel. Somebody has butt her urn. Give me a call on the towel, Holy Spirit. Somebody feel like you are their destiny for you guys to be together. Seven of Wands. You feel like you guarded towards this person. And my nose itching. You set up boundaries to this person. And this person is going through a towel for me. Because they wasn't expecting that. Somebody thought that shit was funny having you wait and play games. Now somebody realizing I had I had the I had I had the like I had the Empress. Ain't nobody messing with the Empress. Like I had that in my hands and my palm. Mm, I had that. Now somebody waking up. Now somebody waking up. After they realize they put you through a lot. Somebody was childish. Now something you close out a cycle. But this person wants to hold on to you and offer you something. Whoever this person that take that took a long time, somebody is in their thoughts. They're thinking about how can I come back and make things right. But I feel like with this guard, you guys are very guard. You had this person blocked or you just you know you're not giving this person no access to you. But somebody's trying to figure out how can they come towards you and make things right. Give me a card on the Five of Swords, Holy Spirit. The Shrimp card. <laughs> Somebody mad. They ain't know how strong you was, I'm telling you. Somebody thought that you would always be there because I feel like you just have this very pure, innocent... Um, energy about you where you was very loving and caring. And somebody played on it and somebody respecting that. Yeah, page of wands, knight of cups. You could be a messenger or but somebody could be wanting to message you and offer you something. Yeah, the emperor. Okay? I feel like somebody overdid their authority. Somebody overdid their control. Somebody can, I'm telling you, somebody can either work in a legal system Also, could be a firefighter, but somebody just thought they shit didn't stink. They really did. They thought they shit didn't stink. They thought you was gonna always be there, okay? 
But I feel like you blocked this person now. Five of Pentacles, nine of cups. They thought they <laughs> They just knew that they had their wish fulfillment in the bag. Yeah, this person was toxic. Capricorn or Libra energy. Somebody was toxic as heck. But something is about to be made fair. Something is definitely about to be made fair. Okay? You're going to be um, it's receiving some type of... Um, somebody want to come to you and bring you some type of honesty or some type of truth. But with the Eight of Wands in reverse, it's like you're blocking communication from this person because I feel like you know this person is toxic. You know this person is jealous of you. Yeah, but with the... Could be a Capricorn, but with the Knight of Pentacles... Um, whoever this person is that took long to bring you an offer, okay? With the um, hangman, I feel like this person was in some type of stagnation. Like, they was... They felt like um, they didn't have to move, okay? But now there's somebody that's... Um, it's giving me somebody trying to surrender, okay? Or looking at things from a higher perspective. Yeah, you could be deal definitely dealing with a Capricorn. I feel like whoever this person is, they ain't put you first, I see. They did. Give me some more messages, Holy Spirit. Give me some messages on this empty. Yeah, I'm telling you, so I see they was being childish. Somebody thought they could, you was going to wait. Leaving it behind. Somebody is walking away from the childish game. Like I just said, somebody is like, I'm walking away. Yeah, signs of symbolism. Okay, with the Empress and the Queen of Swords, I feel like, like I said, you very loving, you caring, you are the beautiful divine feminine. Very compassionate, understanding, caring. But at the same time, somebody didn't know that you could set up boundaries at the same time too. Okay? Somebody knew that you was the person with the profile meant to be, but they felt like you was going to stay and they could just, you know, put you on a back burner. Somebody's mad because you're strong. You paid attention to the signs and symbolism. This person definitely has codependency or um, issues. Yeah, this person is very problematic. Okay? A fight could have broken out. This person could have lost their job. Things could be just falling out of this person's life. New line of stuff. Yeah, because of that manipulation... That manipulation that this person was trying to do to you, okay? Sending you the evil eye, wishing ill on you. You was receiving signs and symptoms from the universe. You observed things before you bust any moon, okay? And you knew that it was very, you was, um, whatever guidance that you got, you knew that I have to leave this behind. This person ain't real right. Now everything is falling at this person's life. And the only person that they could think about is the one that was so, you know, loving and caring and, you know, um, you know, always spoke to the um, the God or the goddess in me. But they mistreated you. They overlooked you. They thought it was funny and thinking you was going to still be there. And now that things are falling out their life, they only, they think about you. Yeah, they think about this upgrade stuck who upgrade stuck in the past. They didn't put you first. This somebody having a lot of sexual fantasies about you, obsession. This, guy, this person could be sending you some type of sexual energy as well. If you feeling like, you know, um, you know, um, out of nowhere, you feeling like some type of sexual urges, this person could be trying to send you some sexual energy. And that is the truth, okay? But Spirit is saying this phase will end soon. Give me a card on the five of swords, Holy Spirit. Please and thank you. Yeah. Bonded and rumors. Whatever this person, whatever lies, whatever rumors that they were spreading about you, okay? Dick and shit was funny. Wanted you to be in, and you know, be caught up in this in this um conflict. I feel like this is somebody that was sending you a lot of spiritual warfare too. They were, they were. What's this Holy Spirit? Yeah, they was lying. They was lying. They was lying. Somebody wanted you to be bonded to them, but they, so you just keep being ten steps ahead of this person because you received guidance from the Most High. Somebody stuck in the past. Somebody's stuck in the past, but I feel like your life has moved forward. You're definitely getting upgrades. You moved on with your life. Somebody wants you to let down your guard. Spirit, before we close this out, give me a card on this new line of study. Knight of Wands. Could be a fire sign. Somebody, a very flighty energy. Somebody who thought they was going to manipulate a situation. 
Yeah, but justice is here. Libra energy. Okay? Somebody's about to receive karma for what they did to you. Okay? Something also could be very significant about October, which is next month, which is Libra sis um Libra um Libra season. I believe Libra season start the end of this month though. But something gonna be very significant about Libra season. Or this whoever this Libra is or this Sagittarius, somebody's gonna be receiving karma. Yeah, they reflect it because yeah, look. Seven of Pentacles, Two of Cups, and Seven of Wands. You set boundaries with this person. Yeah. Now this person is trapped in their head. Mm-hmm. Something is, yeah. I feel like somebody let you down. And they and somebody that somebody made something seem one way, but they let you down. Look at this, y'all. You know what, Sun Seeds. We got the Emperor, Eight of Wands, Empress, and Queen of Swords. I can never make it up. Look at this. Empress, Queen of Swords, and look what came back out. Whoever this emperor is wants to communicate with you, but this empress is setting up boundaries. Somebody wants you to open up. Somebody wants you to let them in. Okay. Mm. Wow. Somebody messed up. Cautious. Black magic. Transformation. Every time somebody thought they was going to play with you, you will go through an upgrade, an upgrade. You will transform to, you can have Scorpio heavily in your chart. For a lot of you guys, it could be in Pluto, but you always, you, 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 you transform every time. Every time something happens to you, you just transform and come back even better. Somebody else is stuck between course rules, tarot reader and projection. You could be a tarot reader, okay? But or somebody, if you're a tarot reader, somebody was definitely projecting a, um, some type of energy towards you, okay? For some of you guys, this could be a work situation. Like I said, um, a lover, um, a family member. We see the center cups. Take the energy how it resonates to your story. But now somebody is shook, okay? This could be somebody that's somewhere smoking a cigarette or something, but they shook. And if you look at this tarot reading card, whoever was projecting, or you guys could... Um, be receiving your guidance through tarot reading, watching me, okay? <laughs> but if you look closely on this card right here, it's judgment, okay? For a lot of you guys, you have moved on. Somebody treated you cold. I'm picking up on heavy. This is a relationship, two divine kind of. Somebody treated you cold, yeah. Seeing through the fog, but it wanted to come up in reverse. Somebody didn't want you to see them for who they were. But skeleton, secrets are about to be revealed. You got four Empress cards out here. This one, her, and the other deck. And you have Empress and the Empress in the little deck. You are very inspirational to this person. Somebody is regretting what they did. Period. I love you, Sun Seeds. Um, until we get up the next time in, in the next video. Yeah, actual travel life purpose. Somebody's on their life purpose. Somebody is just, you know, focused. Tunnel vision.